Hey guys, welcome back to the channel for another video. Great to see you today, thanks for stopping by. Generally on this channel, we make videos about my C6 Corvette or my Audi A3. Um, not gonna be about either one of those today, so picked up a new, uh, a new vehicle over the weekend and I wanna show you guys what I got, so let's go. As you can see, it's uh, just a pretty basic Chevy uh, 1500 Silverado pickup truck. Nothing super crazy or special about it. Um, the reason I bought this truck specifically, I have a good story for it, and I'll get into that here in a little bit as well. But this truck is really clean for for its age. Um, it's It's got 128,000 miles on it, power nothing, which is fine with me. Nothing's gonna break on it. Everything being manual, like the windows, door locks. Very basic um, pickup truck though. It's got a radio and an air conditioner blows cold. The heat does work. I tried that out this morning as well. Um, it's got the rubberized floor in it, which I do like too, because I can put the dog in here and the kids in here and not necessarily worry about anything like that, uh, getting dirty or getting mud inside of it, which is nice. Um, he, the, the previous owner took really good care of it. As you can see, the ashtray has never been used. Um, these plugs down here have never been used. And like I said, the seats are all ripped up in it. Um, it doesn't have, you know, a lot of uh, dings or anything. It does have some rust, but it's pretty typical for Chevy trucks of the era. Right here down here on the rocker. So I'm going to replace that or put covers on it. Haven't decided which. Um, at the end of the day, it's not a huge deal because they all pretty much have it unless you're paying, you know, a real high premium for your, your pickup truck. And I bought a pickup truck more for the utilitarian factor than the... Uh, I guess you'd say daily. I'm gonna daily this, but uh, it's not gonna be. You know, I, I don't. I have a hard time justifying spending forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty thousand, a hundred thousand dollars on a pickup truck. To me, this is a tool. I bought it to haul stuff around. I could put a sheet of drywall in it. I could put the dog in it. I put the kids in it. I could throw bicycles in the back. Um, you, you know, I, I was thinking about getting a camper, so it's got a tow hitch on it. I can tow a trailer with it. It's just I bought it more more to use it as a pickup truck than anything, and I, it, I'm really enjoying it so far. I've been driving it for about two days now, kind of as my daily. Um, the motor on it, it's the 5.3 liter Chevy uh, Vortec motor. It runs. Real fires right up every time it does have one engine code on the inside of it but it's not the, the biggest deal it's a service engine soon light and it's from the um i'll have to look it up i forget exactly what it is but there's it's a service engine soon light it's not check engine but all in all it's it's a pretty good truck it's solid um like i said the, the previous owner took good care of it there's not a lot of dings in it or anything their bodies you know it's gonna it's gonna need a little bit of love but that's okay um that's kind of why i like these kind of trucks though it's it's analog it's old but everything works on it like i said there's not power power on it or anything but everything works nice big bed bed liner in it already um i'm gonna use it for for that kind of for pickup truck stuff i actually got to do my first pickup truck thing the other day i was uh driving driving this home on the first day i got it and um yeah more rust on this side on the rockers unfortunately um I, and i stopped on the side of the road and there was this air conditioner it said free it was a window unit air conditioner i'm thinking about installing it in my garage so i put it in the back of my pickup truck and took it home but it's uh it's pretty roomy too it's got the full bench in the front um, plenty of room for my son he's two he likes actually he prefers this i think to any of our other cars now um he he climbs in this and like just likes to play inside of it which is fine with me i put the parking brake on it and uh you know when he's inside of it so he can't throw it in gear because he would do that he's that kind of kid 
But all in all, for what it is and the amount of time I've had it for, I really do like driving this old this old pickup truck. Uh, it's got the the metal bumper, so I don't really about parking it in a any sort sort of uh, compromising situations where uh, I'm worried about it getting dinged up or anything. It's uh it's got a lot of power in that in that 5.3 liter Vortex still. And uh, for what I'm going to use it for, it's been it's been good, but I've only had it for you know three four days. But let me know in the comments what you think about uh, this pickup truck. What you pay for something like this? Uh, it is a two wheel drive truck, as I mentioned, with literally no options. But yeah, I just wanted to introduce you guys to my uh, my newest purchase. It's my Chevy Silverado 1500. It's a 2001. So thanks for watching, guys. See you guys soon when I do a deeper dive and review on this. If you haven't yet do me a huge favor and hit that subscribe button below it really helps me grow this channel thanks again see you guys soon